After a decade of planning and around 1.2 billion euros, the European Central Bank's new headquarters in Frankfurt is almost finished. Unfortunately, it's already too small. The ECB is preparing to take over supervision of all Eurozone banks in November of next year, around the same time the new building is slated to be finished. But the 185 meter skyscraper won't have enough room to house the 1,000 new banking regulators and support staff the ECB plans to hire. The building has come in upwards of 300 million euros over budget, thanks to increased construction costs and other challenges which were flagged up in 2012. The ECB couldn't have predicted that it would take over supervision of Eurozone banks when it began planning the new headquarters in 2001, a spokesperson for the ECB explained. There is room on the new grounds to build additional workspace, one of many solutions the ECB is exploring, she added. The central bank proudly showed off the progress it's made on the new premises to the press on Thursday. The skyscraper sits in Frankfurt's East End neighborhood, overlooking the city's banking district. It's a fitting place for ECB President Mario Draghi to deliberate with his fellow governing council members from the building's highest floor, where they will meet twice a month.